Hi students, this is Alex here. In this problem they have given A can hit a target 3 times in 5 shots. It means the probability of A is 3 by 5. In the same way, probability of B is given as 2 times in 5 shots, so 2 by 5. And probability of C which is 3 times in 4 shots, so 3 by 4. You can also find their complement that is p of a dash is 1 minus 3 by 5. After simplification it is 2 by 5 and p of b dash is 1 minus 2 by 5 which is 3 by 5 and p of c dash is 1 minus 3 by 4 which is 1 by 4. Now coming to the first subdivision they are asking what are the probability that two shots hit it means exactly 2 shots hit. So P of 2 hit equal to A and B hit and C does not hit. In the same way A hit and B does not hit and C hit. In the same way A does not hit B and C hit. So we have written the expression for 2 hit. So 2 hit and 1 does not hit. So here A and C hit, B does not hit. Here B and C hit, A does not hit. So we have written in the cyclic order. We have to substitute the values. So this is 3 by 5 into 2 by 5 into C dash is 1 by 4 because P of C is 3 by 4. So 1 minus 3 by 4 is 1 by 4. And again this is 3 by 5. And P of B dash we calculated here. This is 3 by 5. And P of C is 3 by 4. Plus P of A dash is 2 by 5. And this is P of B. P of B is 2 by 5. And P of C is 3 by 4. We have common denominator which is 100. In the numerator it is 6 plus 27 plus 12. Totally it is 45 by 100. Then coming to subdivision 2. They have given at least 2 shots hit. Then it is at least 2 hit. It is either 2 hit or 3 hit. So P of at least 2 hit equal to P of 2 hit or P of 3 hit. Already 2 hit we have calculated in the first subdivision. So we can use the value 45 by 100 and here all the 3 hit is P of A into P of B into P of C. This is 45 by 100. This is 3 by 5 into 2 by 5 into 3 by 4. Once again, this is 40 by, by 100 is written as it is. This denominator is 100. 3 to are 6, 6, 3, 18. Now adding the numerator, we get 63 divided by 100. 